Hello everybody and welcome to Belle's channel and today we are doing a few things alright so last video we cleared out the Crater Lakes infestation now if you're now oh, let me see um Harry, Harry 97 has two infestations and two ambush camps I don't know whether this would be classed yeah so this one's classed as um whatever that is highway night thing so there's two infestations there we've already cleared out one and there's two ambush camps so this is going to be another what i'm going to do is i've only got enough for one molotov because i found kerosene but i ran out of beer bottles um so this is where i found the stuff and there's a, quite a lot of freakers here at night so do be warned um so i'm going to clear out that very last cryo nest with my last molotov we're going to head up and clear the ass Aspen Butte Ambush Camp. We will get 2750 trust, 1700 credits, 5000 XP, and a craft recipe. Um, I think purely because now we're finding a lot more um, thingies, I want to get an incinerary bolt. As you can see, once I clear out one more ambush camp, I will get that. So that is kind of what I'm aiming for, to be honest with you. Um, because I think I'm going to need that a lot more than, you know, I might, you know what I mean? Because I need Molotov and more. So that's what we're just going to do. And then we're going to go out and clear that ambush camp um, to get that craft recipe. And then we're going to basically pop back to... Sorry, I was looking at that. We're going to pop back to... Uh, where is it? Wizard Island and we're gonna restock basically you know I've got fuel but I don't want to run out um, basically yeah that's what we're just gonna be doing so I'm gonna quickly clear out this last cryo nest um, see it's up there so do be careful when you do this Nest destroyed. Done and dusted, man. That's the few. Gotta be careful with that. You gotta grab everyone you can get. Right, so now we're gonna head to the Aspen Butte ambush camp where we're gonna take that down basically. Um and then we're gonna yeah with them because it should allow us to get through as you can see and then we might even try and go that way around and do that. Cause this appears to be very rocky mountains. And yeah look we can't I can't even go there. Can't even get back. <laughs> um that's what we're gonna do basically. So yeah, we're gonna refill all our saddlebags and do all of that basically. Let's ride down here. I'm hopefully gonna be able to refuel my bike and rest at this ambush camp I am hoping I'm also gonna grab some stuff from here one of these murdering sons and bitches.
shit. Shots. They theoretically shouldn't know where I am. Killing drifters, is that it? How do you like it now? Come on. Lift that pretty little head of yours. Come on, you mother... I swear to God, some, peop some of these people are blind. Helicopter. Thought this area was being no fly zone. So there's 15 dudes here. Hold on. Let me check my skills. Oh. If you look, <sighs> let's fucking hope this works. Ability to stealth attack heavy freakers but also the ability to kill heavy freakers and large animals while escaping a grapple that's when they grab you so <sighs> thank fuck for that this is a knife I just got trophy ah so it means I kill a break so to get that trophy you need to kill a breaker or a reacher or a rager with a knife so obviously I just killed a breaker using stealth kill so that one worked in my favor all right what I'm gonna try and do is get over there without the sniper seeing me
Move it. There's another one. I got you now, asshole. There we go. I think this this is where you'd be if they caught you. Hmm. Um. So it's funny because they have such a big camp that they don't. Some of them don't even know what I'm here. I haven't even wasted any ammo. I feel right proud of myself. Oh, I know what that is. That's for track. Oh shit. How many's left? Five. One, two, three, four. Pop off the red. You can. Hold on, let me get my focus stamina. Shoot him in the head. Oh, he's behind there, right? We're good. Two bolts back, reload. Actually, I want to just pop back up here really quick. Because there's ammo here. It's just fucking like gross, man. I don't know what body that's on about. your days of setting ambushes around here are over. Bottle. For you. Ammo. I wonder if they have a bunker around here. I'll bet they do. Oh, okay. So the bunkers like here. Here's the hatch. Yeah. No oh, shit. One. I just used the wrong thing. Right, there we go. Hatch. So it's in the big the brick shed. Makes sense if you think about it. So yeah, we can pop down here now. my mic away from my face, a bit close, so you can see they've been tinkering. To be honest, there's not a lot of stuff in these bunkers that you can like play with. Anyway, so they got a map. Hello. This should help open up a lot Looks more stuff. Pretty good. So Aspen Butte, 
Ambush count 5000 XP, 2750 trust, 1700 um, credits, and now we're at 57% of Ambush Hunter Killer. And we just got the incinerary bolt, which I am looking forward to looking at. So you need cedar sapling, kerosene, rag, and a scrap. And obviously, using that once gives you three bullets. I wonder if it looks on fire. No, it doesn't. Alright, so now you can sleep or go to gun locker and fill up all your ammo. You can't unfortunately fill up your saddlebags. It's kind of annoying, but you know. Um I would try and do as many quests as you can before you need to fill up your saddlebag. If you've got two saddlebags, that's eight hundred you know, that's that's eight hundred credits so obviously when you upgrade that again you're probably gonna have an even higher amount anyway I don't see fuel which is kind of pissing me off um, I was hoping there would be some ah oh, there it is okay so it's under the tunnel thing there's some fuel uh, tower not tunnel I wonder if you can go up there I don't see the point. There's not going to be anything up there, I'm sure. Alright, let me get back to my bike. I just like to grab some of this stuff. Because it allows you to craft. You know, so you need mate. Mayweed for health cocktail. Quite a few of those. I'm glad I can kill breakers like stealthily. Like you need bris bristly manzanta. That's obviously just picking any, and I need a mushroom for that. I find that another time. Anyway, sorry that took a bit longer than expected. But when there are 15 enemies, it's going to take longer. Why are these? Why is there like constant bodies just popping up? How much cedar? Oh shit, I need to get some more. Oh, there's some more over there as well. There's a lot over here, so if you need cedar sapling, come to the Aspen boot thingy. Shit, where did I just drop that? Over there. Sorry, I swore them. I'm trying to stop swearing a bit. I've been doing it a bit too much. <laughs> Alright, where's my car? There we go, Bristley Manzanita. Manzanita. Never even heard of that. My poor bike. Oh my god, Deacon. That always happens when I. Oh, I was on the chair for a little bit. There we go. So I'm always over half fuel. Yeah, like 46, so I need. Come on, Deacon, wake up. There we go. Never make it over that mountain without some fuel. That should be it. Whoa. So this is the map that it opened. We're in Highway 97 region. That kind of reminds me of like Nero. I would love it if that was Nero. There is a Camult Community College Nero checkpoint, but there is an infestation there. So you got one, two, three, four, five, six, six nests at that area. Um, so here's like it's three on the highway, one in that thing, and two on either side of that courtyard. There's also a historical monument careful of that highway I think that's the highway that has all the halls and that does take you into another area over there so yeah I think that's the highway 90 something there's, there's also a cryer nest over there nice little well, nice little big area over here with two fuel stations a near a research site I don't, I don't know where the fuck I am there's another near a research site up there and there appears to be another camp of some sort. So we're going this way anyway. 
Hopefully it's not too dangerous. But you know, you never know. I kind of thought we were going to go through this tunnel. I just had a feeling. I oh, know I'm full up with all fuel. Okay. Hopefully this isn't too dangerous. All right, I'm seeing. <coughs> I gotta burn them out. I gotta make it safer to ride. Well, oh, okay, so there's nests in here. That's it. I'm waiting for some nests and some tunnels. Alright, tunnel will not too bad. Come back later, finish burning out these nests. Oh, another Nero site. Jesus. This place is a nest, isn't it? There's a nest over there. How many nests have we got in this area? There's two nests, so that must be. This must be these two nests in the Cradle Lake region. Because as you can see, it has two infestations. So one inside the tunnel. Oh no. Oh no, it's on top of the tunnel. Like that. Oh, that's not too bad then, is it? Alright, good to And then we're gonna... Well, wonder if there's anything in that MMU. Yeah, I'm not doing this one. I'm getting fed up with MMUs. That just pissing me off a bit. I'm still not for going up against the horde, but I'm not too bothered about going up against a few freakers. I spent the night. That would be my suggestion. If you're a bit worried and you know you don't like going out at night because it's pretty scary and stuff, I would suggest just one night going out. Even if you wait a couple of hours, I would suggest just one night. Wait. wait. There's another ambush camp there, by the way. They've got shit. This this area is like a freaking scary zone, isn't it? That one looks really scary to me as well. Um, of course, even though the map's open, we haven't been over that way, so we probably aren't going to go over that way. Anyway, I'm just going to follow this now. The tow truck there, if you need fuel, might just do it just for safety. Fuel cans always respawn. Good. God, there is a lot of emergency vehicles around here. You got police and everything. Oh shit! I just saw it.
You motherfuckers think it's funny ambushing people. Oh shit, I'm gonna stop leaking. Not fucking funny. Oh, dicks. Excuse me, language, I'm sorry. Oh shit. Reload, reload, reload. There's bound to be more of them. Did you just hear the bird tweet then? That was so cute. <sighs> Alright. Let's look for stuff. Put them back. What's that? Dog toy, that's the second time I found a dog toy. Alright, well, let's get my bike up. It's fully broken, my engine. It doesn't look too bad. Alright, I took five scrap to fix fully. Alright, let's carry on. See, it's called Crater Lake because, as you can see, there's an incline all leading to obviously that. Do I can I? Yeah, but obviously, you wouldn't want to jump down there. The only problem I can see is that probably would have been a great place to like get as many holds possible into, you know. That many holds that and then just nuke it, napalm it. Everything, man. Oh. Where is it? God damn, nest. It's gotta be close. Cry nest. I There's smell a nest. Three down here. Be right here. Another nest. Let's go. As you see, there was tons of cry nests. They're pretty prominent around in cryers. Sorry, I'm just gonna go a look at this. I don't know what I'm looking for. Oh. All right. It's a shiver. Still got this. Now, I'm going to say, whenever you're following one of these things, don't exactly follow the footprints. That leads you into traps. So, like, go around it a little bit. Yeah, 
knew it. Run all you want. I got you now. He's hiding in shrubs. Got him. That's the problem with that. They're always coming for these things. I don't get wh why they would think if there was like a cache of some stuff. That makes more sense. That's why I don't get this. You know what I mean? Like if there was a cache of, you know, maybe supply or something, or a box of food or something, and Deacon's then following it. That makes sense. <laughs> Bottle. Igniter. Gunpowder. All that stuff. This is uh, some pretty good loot in here. Jesus, my orders are big out here, isn't they? Oh, I suppose. Why does it keep doing that? So I suppose this was the clue to look at that. I don't know. I'm still trying to find fuel. You would have thought that dude would have come here and got on all these trucks. Oh, ladders there, that makes sense. Oh. Should have found bloody fuel. see it. Not that you'd help me, but anyway. Let's just go. We wasted a long time here. Um Yeah, so basically follow the road or whatever it's taking us on. Oh bloody Right. There we go. Alright, let's go. That was my fault completely. Switch decisions. I'm not good at following that mouse. Can never tell the lines. Jesus, deer crossing. Good or bad? Oh, I think that's just a I think that's just an area. There are a lot of 
police car, isn't there? Jesus, there was a tow truck there, by the way. There are a lot. You know. Newts of nests. Another micro recorder. Yeah, it must be cleared to on these things. Two report 2069. Following up on a couple of reports that my supervisor kicked over to me from the SAT surveillance team. Militia patrols have been spotted on eight different occasions at this location. Which wouldn't be remarkable, except they haven't burned it to the ground. So, anyway, that got the attention of my supervisor. Turns out he was right to flag this. Designated Site 307, a 1950s-era vacation house, has become a nest for a group of infected adolescents. Approximately 8 to 12 individuals, depending on migration patterns. Results from blood tests got run on two nest. males. Ooh, I can smell approximately it. 13 and 11. So, that's... Oh, shit. I've gone past where I need to be. Show antibodies and antiviral proteins I smell it. <sighs> frankly, we can't be identify. Us. The lab's going to get back to me. Conclusion? Someone in the militia is running experiments on these little guys. Doing that. Why? <gasps> I bet it's Sarah. Yeah, Sarah. And uh, why? Well, because she's trying to walk the little shits out, and I'm gonna help her. How do I get? Ah. Alright. Save me a trip. Sorry, I'm trying to... She would stop. How do I... There we go. That's where I want to... So we identified, just from that trip, we have identified a lot of bad stuff. <laughs> a lot! I think this really this was just to, like, explore the area. You know, get an idea of where our nests are and things like that. I'm going to have to clear out them if I want to travel places. So, oh my god, you know, that's a great screenshot, man. That is. Anyway. I need to go refuel. Do all this shit. Excuse me, I saw it again. Do all my stuff and get it all ready and things go, like that. Go, go, You gotta move your ass! You think you can outrun the freaks? Hell no! To be honest, even though they're pushing them and that, it is a good idea because people like people need to be soldier ready. You know what I mean? It's a necessity if they want to survive. I feel like this has very gone back to old western 
You know, this is how they used to build forts. They used to get loads of wood, cut down a load of trees, and build forts, basically. I don't know how to... Oh, I see. Oh, it's very glitchy. See it? Ooh. It's fucking annoying. I said frickin' then. Don't even try and tell me I didn't. Alright, so let's see the bounties we got. We got a few bleachers. They're just like strong swarmers. So we can get a few of them gone. Breaker. Screamer. Nuke. Swarmers. Mm. And runners. Nice and hole. criers. I don't know why that says undiscovered because I had a near of it and it said rager. That's the only one we haven't discovered yet. And the same, I don't know, it's actually stuck with the breaker one now. Uh, anyway, there's still okay, the crier then. ones. Okay. Thank you very much. Going, same as yesterday, same as tomorrow, if I had to guess. I uh, don't think I ever asked, but how did you end up out here? No, you never asked. And I never said. Hey, sorry. Okay, then. Okay. <laughs> you be well. See you, Sergeant. This really does remind me of, like, Fallout for the Brotherhood. They say Paladin and Knight. Never and see, uh, what do they call them? The, the drifters? The, the big breakers? Wait. Oh, I know. Breakers. They're like these huge ass guys. I don't know. Big. Like they were roided out wrestlers or something before they became infected. Anyway, so I think we're going to end the video here. Oh my god, I need to heal myself. I think we're going to end the video here. I know we didn't appear to do very much. But we did explore quite a bit. I mean, you know, we we, we started what? Where did we start? <laughs> we started there. Cleared out a nest in the previous video. I think, yes. You know, we took down... Oh, what did we do? We took down an ambush camp. Aspen Butte ambush camp. You know, we found all this information. Got another near a checkpoint, things like that. We went through the tunnel, found two infestations, and a numbers camp. I think, if I'm really feeling up to it, I'm gonna go to the ambush camp, take that out, take out the river infestation, do that near a checkpoint, and then also take out the Rimview Ranch infestation. And for that, I need to get six Molotovs, and I need to build up my supply again. So I might do a few missions and whatnot. That that's got a lot of infestations. The most I've ever seen, uh, six is the biggest I've ever seen. Um, but yeah, we've got a few things really, like for quests. We got the bounty hunter storyline, and we got the leave all that by the door thing. Um, so we have got a lot to do. Um, there is a, quite a few research sites, but I don't really know how to get to them very well. I have trouble. He said something about a nest, so I don't know. Um, but anyway, so thank you for watching. This is Belle, and goodbye.